Alabama has over 23 million acres of forest and 70% forest cover that supports as many as 40 species per square metre. However, human activities and fire suppression have resulted in changing landscapes with 25% of native flora now facing extinction. Planting native species can be beneficial to preserve Alabama's bustling flora. Here are eight native tree species in Alabama you can plant to help curb native flora and fauna extinction. Longleaf pines, which were once common in Alabama, now exist only in isolated pockets, endangering the forest ecosystem they once supported. Despite this, they remain an important timber source, but their growth requires patience as they grow very little in the first two to ten years. Sassafras is a deciduous tree with three-lobed, mitten-shaped leaves and a spicy aroma emanating from its twigs. The tree thrives in a wide range of soil types and serves as an important food source for wildlife. Gardeners looking for a low-maintenance option should consider the Osage orange tree. Its thorns act as a natural barrier and its fruits attract squirrels and livestock, making it an ideal addition to any farm or backyard. Discover the unique beauty of Virginian witch hazel, a small shrub with twisted golden petals that bloom in fall with a spicy aroma. It grows well in full sun or shade and prefers slightly acidic, organic rich soil. The hardy pecan is a deciduous tree that can grow up to 100 feet tall and 70 feet wide, making this a great shade tree for large properties. It produces edible nuts, has inconspicuous green to yellow flowers in the spring, and prefers full sun and well-drained moist soil. The black cherry is ideal for year-round interest with its glossy green foliage, fragrant white blossoms, little black cherries and appealing bark. This easy to grow tree produces small rounded cherries which, although bitter, are enjoyed by birds and other wildlife. Sourwood, although slow growing, will reward you with a slender trunk, narrow oblong crown and stunning crimson and purple foliage in the fall. In the summer, the tree produces tiny, creamy white flowers which draw bees and are followed by silvery seed capsules. These remain on the tree during winter, contrasting appealingly with the red foliage. The American persimmon, famous for its orange edible fruit in the fall, is easily grown in average, well-drained soils in full sun or partial shade. Its leaves are glossy green that turn to red, purple, yellow or pink in the fall. In Alabama, planting native trees is a means to restore the historical forested landscapes that have been destroyed by urbanization and to support the ecosystems that originally existed there. Just be sure to pick varieties that are suitable for your growing zone. To check your growing zone, visit us at treevitalize.com and for more information about each of these trees, visit the link in the description below. Thanks for tuning in today. I am Fernberg for Tree Vitalize. Please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, and get planting today.